No, I'm not gonna let him shoot. Oh! Oh my god. It's alright, boy. Oh! It's your time. I deserve that. I shot myself. Thank you. We're trying to find the guys that shot and robbed my daughter and threatened her. This whole crew is like changing their appearance every time they go in something. Oh, they're shaming someone in the, in the stockade thing. I created the world's largest Wild West Airsoft role play game at my field, Alahack Airsoft in Chesapeake, Virginia. Yeehaw! And let me tell you, we are having a blast so far. Right there. Now, why'd you guys gotta open fire on us like that? So far, I've gotten six out of the 11 achievement points needed to win the medal victory coin, which is what I really want. Notably, we traded some illegal chickens for a big surprise. It's worth one of these. He gives us a giant gold brick, of which I think there's only three on the whole land. Okay. <laughs> we take the train to the town and meet with the mayor where we sell a low number land deed for yet another brick of gold. Stoked about our new fortune, we tried to sell it at the bank, but ended up buying one from him for $400 from Doug's bank account. Problem is, I didn't tell Doug I used his account. He was off looking for my daughter, who was lost and got shot and robbed by bandits. So here I am, looking for revenge. But my daughter doesn't remember what they looked like. So here's the here's what's going on. You can't really confirm that that was them, right? Yeah. You gotta know by their appearance, otherwise they're just people. We might gotta let go of that. Yeah, but like if that. you recognize someone and you know yeah. it's them, I feel like no, I, I I'm probably, I can't remember that. Okay, that's all right. We can't guess. We have to know. What's up? Hey, have you seen any uh? Any what? Highwayman? No. No. Anybody got a map? Yeah, we own one of those. Why are you looking at me like that? I can. I can. Do you want me to sign that on the wood or do you want me to sign it with this? Okay. Gotcha. Swamp sniper. There you go, brother. And what's your name? Travis. Travis, you're awesome. Enjoying the wild? Yeah. There's a group of three people right there, Madison. Was that them? I'm sorry, I, I mean, it's okay. I can't remember who shot me from right there. That's okay. All right. Is there a prospector that way? Prospectors all the way in the north. Man, I want to find who robbed her. <sighs> yeah, where are we going? John says we should get cash from the bank. Oh, okay. Yeah, you want to get, oh, we never get small cash. Yeah. Doug, I did something huh? that I probably shouldn't have done and I don't want you to be mad at me. Took it out of my account? Yeah. Okay. I, you gave me that money. No, for a whole nother gold nugget. For a whole nother gold bar. All right. Okay, I didn't take all of your money, but I paid $400 for one of those gold bars because that thing's gonna be at least a couple grand. Let's hope it was worth the investment. Oh, and they said that they were gonna know where oil was. Yeah. Right. See that guy in the blue shirt? Looks like who she first described shot and robbed her. You don't know if it was them? She says she really doesn't know if that was them. That's all right, sweetheart. So we can also ask about oil while you sell that. Mm -hmm. And you do what you want with it, but we could use a bunch of ones or something. You know, you know? That people are stealing turkeys in this town and nobody's doing a darn thing about it. People are really excited about turkeys. Remember Birdman from episode one? What do you have? Only the biggest, featheriest, wild. most wildest bird ever, we ever did find back there. And all it's gonna cost you is 50 little dollars, man. $50, who? $50 for my bird. How, uh, who would I sell it to? You would sell, I, uh, how many people do you know that has a bird? Plant. All right, you right there, sir, you General got a bird? Store? Do you, have, you a bird? have a bird? Do you have a bird? See, he doesn't Nobody have a bird. bird, he doesn't have a bird. I bet you money he doesn't have a bird. All I'm saying is, it's better to have a bird than to not have a bird. What was ironic about that is, we actually had three birds on us, the illegal chickens at the time. Oh, he was the one that you first thought it was. Hey, Doug, he was the guy that had the vest on and all that kind of stuff. So you think you recognize him? It's on the ground. Dear Chris, I am from the future. To be precise, from the year 2043. 
All right, to Jasper Davis again, I'm gonna have to read these in a little bit. Um, Madison is saying she really thinks that's him. He's acting so shady. Please kill him. Madison, do you want to take this and I'll go do something? We got it from the mayor for Lampa. Move your water. Move your water. Move your water. What are you doing? All right. Before I could even turn my head, Doug is just marching off in the distance to kill that man. He's, he's going to go kill him. Right? I I what a brave soul. I need to find out why the food isn't cooking yet for everyone. Lord, did someone talk to you about grilling? Someone um, offered to cook the hot dogs. Let me find that gentleman. Yeah, He'll be back Let's pay them like a hundred dollars to cook all the hot dogs. You know what I mean? Oh, right now, oh. cook hot dogs. What do we got? Like two packs? Hundred dollars. Cook the hot dogs. Uh, that means start the fire too. Do you have that to pay him? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, okay. We just gotta pay people to fire that up and cook the hot dogs. Lord. What's up? Yeah, you had something for me, you said. That's actual real gold flakes. Oh, dude. That's awesome. What's your name? Andy. Andy, that's awesome. I love your holsters. Thank the whole the whole setup's awesome, man. Andy, thank you. Anytime. Very much. Anytime. How about every uh, minute you give me another one of these? <laughs> there we go. There we go. Awesome. There we go. What? You killed him. Or like I contracted some random guys to kill him, but you know. Oh, cool. But you gotta rob him. We gotta rob him. We gotta rob him for killing Madison. We want all of his money. Then kill his friend. Kill them, take all of their money. They don't mess with it. Lord, I just said kill them and take all of their money right in front of a Pinkerton. Let's see how this goes. Talk to the mayor about your property? We did, yeah. How'd that go for you? It went well. He gave us something that we were like, this is super valuable. And then the bank is like, must be suffering because the bank's like, oh, that's uh, only this much. It's the nicest it. item I've seen in the whole game. Well, we've been talking with Sheriff Candy and his deputies. You hear about the election going on? I know there's an election tomorrow. Lady. The woman. Yeah, woman, sorry. Yeah. So, it is. From, from what we heard, he's poisoning the moonshine. He then basically describes he's trying to get a sample of the mayor's moonshine to test it to see if it is indeed poisonous. So I'll look into that for you, but I gotta meet with this if, guy real if quick. If you can find a jar, a single jar of moonshine, I'll pay you for it. We need, we need to check. I know where you can How much do you pay for him? 40 bucks. 40 bucks? All right, that's good to know. We'll be on the lookout. 271 and 308 are the plots of land so far that have a lot. And we don't have those. I'm not sure, I'd have to check. Oh, let's check, let's, let's check right in here. 271 sounds familiar, man. Yeah. Actually, 308 sounds familiar. If you watched the first two episodes, you know we have a lot of land. And here's the deal. If oil was struck on our land, every two hours it produces a $500 oil bond that cannot be looted. We want that. 271 and 308. 277. Oh, God. 286. That is the money. Lot one. 284 and 292. And, then that's and the lots that have oil. That's 300. 271 so. 271 Okay, well, maybe the next plot we will. Gosh, that's disappointing. Why, why didn't you get those numbers, dude? Why are you so sassy to me, Fulcher? You know what we should do? We should just ask people about land. Send some friends on a friend mission. Nice. Like the video if you think Doug is a boss. If you got land for sale, come to me. Yeah, no one wants to sell their land. And maybe they know they have oil on it. I know where there's some really good stuff if you got land for sale, make it worth it. What lot you got for sale? What lot do I not have? <laughs> <laughs> C, 283, 279, 290, 280. Oh, okay. Well, oh, okay, they're not really all that impressive. Good for huh? you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I mean, hey, a lot of land, but no oil. Did you get small change for that gold nugget? How much did he give you? 20? Okay. Okay, that makes, at least it's consistent. What? That looks shady. How much for, uh, for a sandwich? So I want to tell you all the sandwiches, the food today. Ordinarily, we are talking $1 for a sandwich. However, by virtue of the woman, lunch is paid for. Oh! The woman for mayor. The woman for mayor. 
Woman for mayor! Woman for mayor! That's a smart political move on her part. <laughs> that's that's funny, man. Hey, yeah. I've heard that female turquoise. How many do you have? Hey, remember, that food was provided by the woman. Yeah, that's brilliant. She paid for everyone's meal for the whole day. Yeah. The sheriff wants to know. He sends his regards. Ah, oh my God! The live stream it attacks. There it is. The man who plays Sheriff Candy is also the Candyman from Rev. One of the most humble, cool guys I know. His YouTube channel is C7 Viper. Check him out. If wanted players are brought in, they either get to choose a jail cell or to be shamed. Oh, I haven't gotten to witness this yet. Everyone, gather around. We have shame. 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 What have we done? They chose to be shamed instead of going into jail. <laughs> oh my gosh. This event is one of the nerdiest and funnest things that I have ever created. The people who bring it to life are amazing. We decided to take a journey out of town. We're thinking about going to find that uh, that barrel with the silver cross for the mayor. I need a barrel that has a silver cross on it. Down there in the south end. There was a cow nearby from what he'd tell me in legend. You bring that to me and not get the attention of the sheriff and get things going. All right, sounds good. I've got five more achievements to do to accomplish all 11. We're going over by the cow. I wish we had thought to take the train because it is hot. These woods back here, we're looking for a barrel with a silver cross. It could be all the way by the cow, but he kind of pointed in these woods. Now we're looking for the barrel with the silver cross for the mayor. Maybe that will get us prosperity. What? What are they saying? In a good way or a bad way? Bad. Someone who knows Doug explains that people know that Doug has a big gold bar and they're searching for him. This is really not good for our crew. Th hey, thank you for that information. No, I'm wanted? A copy? I'm most wanted? What for? I don't know, they didn't tell me. In the actual newspaper? Wait, outlaw on the loose pictured here. If you see him known as a swamp sniper, be sure to let authorities know ASAP. One of the most wanted men in the West. Mike did that and I didn't even notice. Thank you. But I just wanted to let you know. Okay, thank you. That's terrifying. Appreciate you all. Oh, okay. I think maybe we should put the thing on Doug on you since they're specifically looking for him and for gold. I know that's a lot to carry. We should put it on someone else. Hey, Doug, Maddie could carry it. Awesome. There's no barrel. All right, keep walking through these woods and see. I'll be right behind you. I'm supposedly super wanted. People know Doug has gold. That's not good. We looked everywhere and could not find a barrel. It must have already been taken from someone else. Dang, how are you doing? Doing all right. What you roaming around for? Just roaming. Cool. Get my steps in. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> we just walked a little bit today and I am exhausted. Oh yeah, I didn't sleep last night basically. That's what's going on. And here comes the train after we walked half of the field. Oh. Howdy. Howdy. Oh no. Was that butterfly alive? No, someone found it dead. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. How are you all doing? Good. You about dying out here? It is no snakes. hotter than Hades out here. Gotcha. Well, found a couple of flowers oh, for you. Lovely, thank you so much. That's right, John and Fulcher never got the natural world achievement, so they're knocking it out now. Sir, did you finish skinning any of those pelts of the creatures we shot earlier that you need us to unload? Or you can just move them to the general store. Oh, oh, I'll move them there for you. We've also got some more weird stuff. Someone found this. Oh. How cool is that? Is that from Mario Brothers? Apparently. Oh, 
You guys got any land for sale? I can't say we do. Okay. Well, I do have something for you, though. Oh, really? I'll give it to you for a while, Dad. Let's see. Whoever wants to take these, there's three of them there. Oh, my gosh. All right, and we just bring them to the general store yep. for you? Uh, let me give you a down payment in case he doesn't. Oh, okay. Oh, have you guys heard about the woman? Oh, we have. Yeah. What are your thoughts on that? I support. She also offered to give me a building in town for my museum, so... We were about to have to front a bunch of cash to get some food, and then they announced the woman made it free for everyone. Yeah. So I'm like, I'm all about that. The only Maddie? thing is she's pro-trained. Uh, oh, never mind. She's pro -trained. Oh, she's pro train. You do, you guys don't like the train? No, it's it runs right by my house. It scares off all the things I'm trying to hunt. Why would I support that? You don't like people, then? I don't like the train. Uh, this is for the delivery. All right, thank you very much. Also, be careful. There have been a lot of snakes. Here. <laughs> oh yeah! Snap into a slim. That is the largest. That is the largest slim gem. I have ever seen in my life. And it came from this man whose name is? Uh, Isaiah. Isaiah. The book of Isaiah. <laughs> Isaiah, thank you. I've never, I didn't, I didn't know. Now I know. It's called the Savage. Savage size. But thank you. You know what? I could just beat someone with this if they try to attack me. Yeah. Yeah. That'll feed a whole family of cows. <laughs> You have any ones? We're gonna return the. Um, it's for if you need to buy something small. Which, which, you, which you would be either way, but like. Yeah, no, if you need to buy like a little I'm, something um, small. I'm just still, think still it's gonna be 10 degrees hotter tomorrow. No, it's not. Now we decide to head back to the town to finish the landowner achievement for Doug and Ian by signing over a lot. And we're seriously hoping that I am not still wanted. Madison, I dare you to just shoot this man as he walks up. What? Howdy. You're a good person. <laughs> no, that guy is a, he's a postman. That's the post office I've heard about. This is a robbery. Oh, oh all the money oh you got. Gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's it. That's 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 it's safe. <sighs> Someone trying to buy land? No. Not anymore. No, there's two robberies happening here. I got land for sale. Someone got land for sale? Yeah, if you want to come around. Are, you, are they with you? Yeah. I don't know how many spots you have, though. We have seven. How much money you got? So that would mean you would need two pieces of land to make that happen. I've got 1,200. We got a little bit more. Yeah, and we got a little bit more in the between. Well, we would do one for 1,000. That works. Right. But can you produce another 1,000 and then we'll do two? Yeah. You can? Why don't you guys talk about that, yeah. figure that out? Yeah. See what if you can we, get together? We aren't able to. I mean, think about it. If you're $300 short, you shoot three people, yeah. and if they got money, just get, I mean, that's pretty good because what are the chances of finding two? Because there's nothing left. And they should be going for like two grand a piece, but we'll accept. You want to go do the general store real quick? I love it. It was so fun. Um, we got all the pelts. Oh, I'm going to chill here because I don't want to miss out on that. So if you guys want to run the pelts, go run the pelts. Hey, beautiful, you have a flower in your hair. Hey, guys. How's the price of gold looking? We'll buy. We'll probably buy the, the large bars for time. Yeah? Really? Aha, looks like the price of gold went up. Let's see how much it weighs. Can we see how much it weighs? We got one. Let's see how much ours weighs. No, no, sir, sir. I don't know about all that. But I'll, we'll, we'll see how much ours weighs. Madison points out the guy in the blue shirts in that connex. He might be the one who shot her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, all right. We have another one. Don't mix, the, don't mix those up, sir. Take 1,200? Should we? Twelve hundred dollars for the oh, yeah, car. The That's your. I'm gonna let you. You do this transaction. You figure it out. Really? Yeah. Thank you. That's a lot easier to get. All right. Well, here's the deal. I know 
got it in the bank and stuff like that. We'll do it for cash. Okay. But we have to do it in front of the banker because he has to sign if you want to buy property. So you get that, get that first. John, you're, this is your, ladies and gentlemen, this is this is John's call. What's he gonna choose? We don't know. So, what's this? I'm gonna go. Fair deal. Hey everyone. Oh, hello there. Why did um, that scare so me? We just we heard that there was some danger in this area. I just wanted to warn you that some there was talk of someone coming in and shooting. And we don't want any of that. So that blue man in the blue yeah. shirt looks very suspicious. That's, I know, Maddie. That's what uh, I'm gonna pay these guys here. Can you make sure money. that that guy's not doing anything bad here, Maddie? You just step over here. Oh, now he's gone. Ooh, he's gone. Ooh, look back and he's just disappeared. Yeah. Let me go keep an eye on the floor. Hey, I'd appreciate that. We're only doing good things. We're helping people buy land because we've got some subdivided land. Hey, here's. And someone just stole our entire cash box. So if you see someone with a black box full of cash, <laughs> how much? How much is it? Uh, that was everything. What did they look like? Are you like dysfunctional now? I was talking now? to you and they. No, I've, I've got something to, to work allowed. with. But... Okay. Colored things, which I also didn't. Oh, your sheriff just got. Whoa, 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 whoa. They're trying to help. Sheriff. All right. Why? I had the box of. I'll return it for you, sir. I'll go to jail, but what do you mean? In the jail. In the jail. Sheriff, you want me to return it for them? Rev him back up. Rev him? Hey, I don't have a bandage. Someone bandage him up there. Madison, can you heal this lawman? How? Wrap it around his arm and then apply pressure for 30 seconds. Anytime you have a chance to visibly look good with the law, you need to go for it. So John just sold a gold bar for $1,200. Pretty darn good. A lot better than 300 earlier. That was ridiculous. And then now we're going to help seven people get property, but we're going to get two grand. Two grand by selling two subdivided lots. So we still technically have like that lot. Well, so oh, oh. Passing by by the door and then they stop. All right. And then they kept on going and they were. Like, the skinny kid wearing all black. He's They're with, dead now. He's with the blue shirt. They're dead now. The, oh, were they trying? The, to? Uh, yeah, they were trying to rob the bank, not you. Oh, okay. They said they want that lockbox. You said you guys. Are I told them I want you to leave town. They said no, and then so some kind what? citizens took so care. You guys are subletting land. Uh, we yeah, are selling land. You got any oil land? Oh, we got it. You got it. Good here. Hey, um, let's do uh, let's produce B and C for that one. Uh, I heard you like beef jerky. Can I throw in beef jerky for good cause? Oh, I'm so sorry, sweetheart. Um, if you give a mouse a cookie, now I want more. I have the two thousand, which is generous, plus the beef jerky, plus a joke. What do you call Magic Owl? Houdini. <laughs> I accept. Hey, Fulcher, you're good at counting. You're good at counting. Come on over here. It is lot 300B and 300C. Yo, we are getting super rich. Mm. Money, money, money. Money. Beef jerky money. Mm. Got we don't got it yet. We're just counting. This is awesome. Who? High five. <laughs> Thank you. You want to check on Doug and Ian? Thirty dollars short. Ooh, what are you guys trying to do? Huh? How much should we have? There, just quick, put that in our account, and we'll just keep these. <laughs> If we get shot, <laughs> if you, oh, what the hell? we could get shot. But hey, sheriff, we got shooting on the west side of the thing of the bank. It's just two thousand. It is. Yeah. Okay. Because we're doing it for a thousand. Per. There is shooting everywhere. They're shooting everywhere. There is a lot of shit. Mr. Banker, these gentlemen, there are seven of them. So they're trying to purchase two lots from us. We have lot 300B, lot 300C, and 
um, they are they have given us the money and we would like that officialized so that they can sign their properties. Yes, sir. They're having come around to the front so we don't get oh, okay. robbed blind from the back. Can okay, we cool, cool. We're just selling land to people, helping them out. Look at this guy. What's up? Great yeah. I'm gonna shoot him in the back. I'm not. <laughs> You're like, what? Oh, you need a chill. Like I said, I hit your trigger finger. Hmm. Very itchy. You did not just say that to me. Oh, ow. That didn't sound fun. Hey! No! Let's... He came up to me and he's like, I got a very itchy trigger finger. Guy in the blue shirt just ran up and shot that dude. That feels good. Is that messed up or is that just fun? I can't wait for you to watch the rest of the series. Also, the last video I said I had a mystery gun giveaway. So here it is. This is not your normal Novridge SSE-18. This is one of the only five prototype SSE-18s that existed that he sent me for the Dude Perfect Snow Sniper video. I had the privilege of helping them out. If you haven't seen the Dude Perfect Airsoft Battles, check them out. Who's it going to? So many of you got the answer correct, but the winner is Mike Ravioli. Congratulations. Business inquiry, email me in the about section. I'll get to your blaster, but for this video, how about I do another mystery giveaway? Ooh, I don't know, it kind of seems more fun not telling you what it is. Winning this one is simple. Like the video, subscribe if you haven't, and comment your favorite movie quote. It doesn't need to be Western related, but just your favorite movie quote. I look forward to seeing what you all come up with. So as always, thank you so much for watching whatever you do in life. Stay safe, enjoy it, be creative, never lose your childlike wonder, and peace.